Good morning and welcome to day 25. I remember. Wow. Welcome to day 25 of life graduation. Today is going to be a little bit of a different day. Today I'm going to experience the photography side of life. I'm going to help a photographer, a high end photographer, with a shoot. And I'm going to experience how that is. I've experienced many shoots already, but not this high end and not. Uh, organized by someone else mainly so I'm, I'm really looking forward to it uh, and for the shoot I need to drop the Amsterdam okay let's go people in the church Amsterdam we meet again the shoot of today is for a high-end photographer like I already said but it's also a very high-end client so unfortunately, I cannot show anything. Um, I asked the photographer and he was like, no, that's not gonna happen. Uh, I understand that you wanna film, but that's not gonna happen because it's too high-end, it's too uh, confidential, pretty much. So the shoot I cannot show, but I'm gonna tell you as much as possible. Um, let's see how it works out. I don't know how long this shoot is gonna take. I don't know who we're gonna take photos of. Uh, I'm gonna see when I get there. I'll probably get explain what I need to do as well. I will do a recap afterwards. One eternity later. It was a super interesting day. I'm on my way back and it was great to see him work his magic. He's a really good photographer. And I think it was really cool to see him create such a simple image but so classically beautiful of people who are not models. But I thought it was a really cool day. I'm on my way back home. It's uh, 10 p.m. So it was a long day. But I would do it again. Since I couldn't show anything of today, I will summarize what happened today. It basically was a photo shoot for a very high-end client with a very high-end photographer. His name is Vicky Hermkens. I will link his portfolio in the description. He makes super beautiful classical style photographs, mainly portraits for brands or from people for magazines, etc. This was my first tryout of professional photography, or at least could experience how photography is as a full-time job. I think it was a really interesting experience. And to compare design versus photography as part of life after graduation, I think photography is still really interesting and it was really nice to see the results and what he can make within a day with a team. However, I am not sure whether I would do his type of photography, even though it's super beautiful and super high-end stuff that many people can be jealous about, including me. But I think I prefer to create a little bit more, create a concept with a story and then tell that story via a photograph. And that's what he didn't do today, at least. What I basically saw today is that you don't have a lot of creative freedom disabling you from creating new stuff, whatever you want. He is really good at photographing people in the most beautiful classical style, which is super cool. But maybe for me, it doesn't show enough of a story. And I'm try I try to be a storyteller with every photo I take. Don't get me wrong. I can still learn a bunch from him and his work, which I would love to do. I would love to assist him more and see how he works on different assignments and different uh, challenges, etc. But design versus photography, I would love to combine a little bit more of design in photography by creating more coherent story, to tell everything with one photo or a series. So I'm not sure whether design is a better option at this moment for life after graduation than photography. This does not eliminate photography by itself. 
just indicates that I probably prefer a different kind of direction with photography. Which is good to know as well, because as, as long as you know what you don't want, you can figure out what you want to do. Interesting, right? More to figure out, more to do. Happy that I learned a lot today and that I had a super cool day, even though I couldn't share it with you. That's it for now. Thanks for watching. And until next time, law of life. Make the best out of it. I'm out. Peace.